What are some potential pitfalls or challenges that content creators and marketers might face when incorporating AI-generated content into their projects? Inexperienced hands, I'll just say that. If it's an exper inexperienced creator, doing like you know using ai they might not be getting the res like you know the results that are you know like the the, the wonderful ones we've been seeing on the journey or something yeah yeah because like, they just might not know how to write a prompt and that's okay <laughs> for now yeah yeah it's i think that's that like the pitfall is inexperience it's like the the main like obvious like pitfall for me would be inex an inexperience on the part of the creator or the marketer or both yeah i think it's definitely part of that definitely the inexperience because it's not as easy as just writing a sentence you have to be very specific in your prompt definitely another thing would probably be citation of sources because mm -hmm. anyone can that's the thing with current how current ai is because some information is inaccurate but even then if when it is where is it coming from i know there's all there's a whole thing of artists being against mid journey uh, because their style is being taken and then it would be nice when these say for example mid journey when it does pull from these styles to cite have citations of art re referenced from this person this person this person this person because right it would be nice for mid journey to have that same thing just to, mm -hmm. to where did it pull this artistic style from yeah credit your artists <laughs> yeah, so, so that way because you know it, it it's already affecting a lot of artists. Mm -hmm. uh, there's a story I saw of an, a concept artist in, an, I, th I think it was an indie game company. He went from being an artist to just doing prompts and then oh. cleaning up the prompt, cleaning up and then- and A also prompt engineer. Yeah, and, and then cleaning up the art. Yeah. So, and which is not what someone who loves drawing and doing concept art would want to do. They want to go start from scratch. They want to use their imagination. They want to actually yeah. use their hands. To do so them. that's like, I mean, I digress. Like the main thing is like that, that would be a challenge of, of citing and then obviously inexperience in creating the prompt mm -hmm. because it is, there is a learning curve. It's not as easy as just like yeah. write a sentence, mm -hmm. but once you play with it, I still, I still say everyone play with it. Even artists, even if you have a resistance to it, know who you're up against, dude. Mm -hmm. Obviously, I think it's very. It would be very ethical for someone to disclose that this content that they put out was created partially or entirely with AI. Because again, and like especially in the climate that we are in right now, that like there's you know, artists and like other creatives that are rallying against like AI generated content, anything AI generated essentially that like involves art mm -hmm. in any form. Um, and I get it, as uh, created myself and like a friend to some very talented artists I'm like I get it and like but also but there's also you know the pushback against any form of AI generated content by just regular like audience people but like you know let's say I put out something and I said oh AI generated the music for this or this one like you know from like the minute 55 mark to minute 20 minute 20 you know two minutes 55 mark like this was generated by ai or whatever then you know some people are like oh you're lazy you're i'm not gonna watch your content anymore you're you you've lost your soul yeah and that's, that's the thing the soul yeah. yeah that's it so hopefully you guys found this episode uh, this useful if you guys got any questions and whatnot comment down below or if you guys are watching this uh, and if you guys are watching this on Spotify or whatnot uh, or Apple Podcasts, give it a five star. Give it a great review. Uh, we're doing all this for free. Mm -hmm. And hopefully you guys are, are enjoying it. And if you guys want to work with us or have a chat with us, feel free to book a meeting with me. All right. See you guys later. Bye. Bye.